the last video, this happened. And the phone came out. I've put this giant great big motor into it with loads of horsepower. And the stock Traxxas tyres just could not take it. Look at that. There's only like a millimetre of glue holding it on. Actually less than a millimetre. So, I've got these wheels from my armour Creighton to try out. Oh no, look, the hole's too big on the wheel. And these wheels are a narrower offset. So when you steer, it rubs on the suspension. So M2C Racing has this, a wide axle conversion kit. Now look, we can steer without it rubbing. Let's get the rest of it all on there. Boom, there we go, ready for action. So this car's got a load of upgrades on there to handle the massive power from this giant hobby wing motor. So we've got M2C motor mount, heavy duty bell crank, ESC mount, hinge pins, and chassis stiffener. Then we've got RPM rear hubs, perfect pass servo hidden in there. Also hidden in there is the M2C drive shaft and steel gears. So I'm gonna put a link down below where you can get all those parts from, where you can get the truck from, and also one of you viewers is gonna win this car. Set up a competition. I'm gonna put a link in the description box for all the details details for that. Right, let's go. Man, that's got some power. It's just wheelie at any speed. You can't do full speed, it's just wheelies. I was making a funny noise. So he's definitely clicking in there. My motto is, if you're not sure what's clicking, just keep going until it stops moving. Then you know what's, stop, what's causing it. Look at that, got all the crew in the house. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh, that was right actually. What do you reckon that noise is, Diff? Max reckons it's weird diff, so we're going to carry on with it till it stops working, then we'll get it back in the shop and sort it out. Oh! <laughs> Where did that go? Oh! Did it land on wheels? Jesus, look at Mark! Where? There. Oh yeah, the same whip! I think you do that again. I reckon I can hit that a bit harder. Man, this thing is taking a kick in. Body popped off. Let's have a look underneath. What's it look like? Everything's looking good. <laughs> Man, this thing is a beast. Oh, that front flip. Yeah. I'd get a feel for it first. All right, front flip. <laughs> M2C tough. That's M2C tough. M2C tough, baby. Oh, oh that diff. All right, guys, this is why front wheel drive sucks. Back to the shop and back in action. But before that, let's have a look to see what the crew have brought with them. Then we'll take the car back to the shop, sort it out, and then take it out again. So this is a Banggood special, and it keeps coming back. Oh, that's Stevens X Max. Mitchell with that is dangerous. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Backflip. Oh. AS and 4S going nuts. I'm surprised the beating is taking. <laughs> oh! Oh, out. Oh, that's turned off. Like a proud father. <laughs> Where's Tiny been recently? I think he's over there. Front end exploded. 
just a body shell mainly. Bro! Uh, on the bumper. Oh, look at that drive shaft completely bent. If it was mine, I'd just straighten it. But because one of you guys are going to win it in the competition, I'm going to fit a new one. Also, let's take it apart and see why it lost drive to the rear wheels. Probably the rear diff. And then we're going to try it out on these paddle tyres. <laughs> Yeah, look at that, all the teeth are ground down. But looking at it, the teeth are not actually ground down that much. It almost appears as if the mesh was loose. I know these are monkey metal gears, but on the X-Max, they just survive and they're the same gears. Next up, new drive shaft. Boom! And now for the front one. Boom! Oh, didn't work. I cannot get this off. I've tried everything, hitting it, this, that. It just will not come off. I've had the ugly dug on there trying to get it off. Cannot get it off. So I'm gonna go onto a live stream. Hopefully one of you guys can help me. Link to my live stream channel is down below. And then, right, let's get back to this video. Right, live stream and then back. Live stream back. Oh, guys, it didn't work. I've tried and tried and tried. And in the end, look, the dry shaft broke. So we first done that ugga dugga, then moved on to that ugga dugga, then onto an even bigger ugga dugga, and then onto this bad boy. So I'm going to put a new hub, new bearings, new shaft, new pin. And also, I'm going to put the old axles back on because with these paddle tyres, the stock width is perfect. Now we've got to put the wing back on. Now this is a major weak spot on the XRT. Sometimes you break it just by landing flat. That can flex over and snap off. So I've got this nylon one here that I got from eBay. Next up, we can get the paddle tires on and then we can take it out for a rip. Look at that. That looks nasty. We're running it on this Onyx light pose because I've got loads of power. Let's go rip. Here we are, on location. <laughs> oh. oh, what happened there? Oh, well, it's still clicking. Oh man, that's gotta be the front diff now. Oh, rear diff, fix now front diff. Oh, oh I wasn't hungry, Kev. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I got myself. Man, these tires are nasty. So here we got the log of doom. We just got to make sure that we don't hit this thing. If we hit that, it's instant death. Nice. Oh. <laughs> By the way, this is the ultimate spec Traxxas XRT. It is fully loaded with M2C upgrades. Hobby wing, big block motor, perfect pass servo. If you want to know all the upgrades, we can get the car from and all the techno babble, link to all of that down below in the description and also you can win this actual car and don't worry it will be fully rebuilt before you get it link in the description you know what i wonder if that's a center diff doing that noise so the only way that i know to find out how we can find what the damage is is just to keep going flat out until it fully gives up the ghost and then hopefully when we take it apart we'll know what's up with it. Ready? Go. Full, full power. Oh. What do you reckon that is? I reckon it's that little input gear. I reckon it's got to be centre diff. <laughs> oh! It's so oh yeah! Why is it smoking? Oh, that happened to yours, didn't it? Yeah, that just melted everything. Got to be centre diff, I reckon. <laughs> oh, oh. Jesus, dude! <laughs> I thought you was over there! Bloody hell! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> He's trying to kill me! <laughs> I thought you can now. Can you see it on camera or not? Yes. All right, well, back to the shop, take it apart and have a look, see what's going on. All right, so we're not going back to my shop, we're going to go to Jason's shop. 
Here we are. <coughs> Jason in the house from Redfin Models. Yeah. We've got a problem. Oh, no. So this car, I bashed it a little bit too much. I've, I've done the diffs, fixed the diffs, and then done the diffs again. So I think something's wrong with it. Also, I think we need a full rebuild to make it like just perfect, like a Redfin special treatment. No problem. So bearings and everything. Yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, so no this, this is like, like almost new again. Yeah, I'll strip it down and change everything. Like yeah. Engine and whatnot, bulkheads and whatnot. Yes. <laughs> So can other people come in here and get their stuff repaired? Yeah, of course. What sort of services do you do? Um, all sorts. We just repaired a mini for someone from London. He was yep. super happy. Shout out to Junior. He's done two X-Maxes this week. Done two, three FG cars this week. Speed run cars, done a boat as well. Torpedo boat. All sorts, yeah. That'd be fancy. So if any of you guys are in the Redfin area, they do car rebuilds, they restore the cars, you can get all your toys and everything else here. So yeah, come to Redfin, check them out. Look at the size of this thing. Great big petrol engine. What do you reckon? Should we get one? So we're down in the Redfin dungeon and this is the cleaning department. So what's this contraption here? Uh, it's a sonic cleaner, 10 litre one. We've got all sorts of things. There you go, one of them. I've just got this car back from Redfin Models. Oh my God, guys. It's almost as good as new. Check this out. We've got new bulkheads, new differentials, new upper bulkheads, new bearings. It looks almost as good as brand new. And don't forget, you can win this car. I'm gonna put a link down below in the description box. So check that out and this car could be yours. Congratulations to Patrick Hood from America for winning the X-Max.